In this video, we will see how to configure radius on Nokia 7750 SS. By default, radius is not enabled on Nokia 7750 routers. And uh, now let's uh, configure this uh, for radius. Firstly, we'll go to configure system and security and under this uh, context we will use radius command firstly and then we will enter the uh, for example we'll uh, enter the server radius server uh, address here for example uh, our address uh, can be this one yes and we will also give a secret key here we can say abc123 yes uh, we will uh, we can set a retry time here for example uh, we can use this one and this is uh, the connection uh, retry time to the uh, radius server and uh, we can set also a timeout value here and uh, we can also uh, set uh, authentication author authorization uh, here uh, with authorization keyword and also for accounting uh, we'll use this accounting keyword now uh, let's check uh, our radius configuration with info command and here as you can see our uh, server radius server uh, has configured uh, with, a, uh, with an IP address uh, here and uh, our uh, secret key is here with uh, hash and uh, our timeout retry time uh, also are uh, configured here and uh, we have enabled authorization and accounting under radius and we can also uh, configure a port uh, here for example port 1000 yes uh, with this uh, our uh, 7750 SR will communicate with the uh, radius server uh, on this port. Lastly, let's check uh, the available commands under this radius uh, here. Uh, as you can see, our available uh, commands are here and uh, we have used almost all of them, uh, but we have forgot uh, an important one here. It is uh, no shutdown command. We need to uh, open uh, radius with no shutdown command because uh, by default it is uh, shut down. Yes. Uh, after uh, our compilation, uh, we'll save uh, our compilation with uh, admin save command. Yes, it's okay. This is basically how to configure radius on Nokia 7750 service routers.